Hi everybody, all my followers, be welcome to another video. So, quick video here today. Um, I'm not going to take you through the ins and outs why I'm doing this. Uh, you will be a video for it if you haven't watched it already. I don't know which one is going to come out. Uh, but basically what I'm going to show you is how to take or is how to retrieve the PIN code um, from a, a Corsa D uh, airbag module. So this is the airbag module. It's a, a SDM unit, uh, as you can see in there. I already have the PIN written in there. I will show you the PIN in a minute, how you get it. But yeah, so this is the part number, etc, etc. And uh, this is my airbag module. The airbag module uh, has a EEPROM, which is right there, or used to be. I just removed it. That's where the EEPROM is. So the letters in there is for me to know the orientation of the chip. Uh, I've just wrote down the, the, the chip type, which is a 95, which just came off a little bit in there. But it's a 95160, and uh, that's where the chip goes. The chip is already here, on placed on my adapter, which is plugged in into Xprog. And we're going to open Xprog now. It's going to be a really quick video, guys. <clears throat> and once you have um, the Xprog open, you're going to go to, in this case, we're going to go to zero EPROM, we're going to select an SD chip in there. We're going to scroll all the way down to find my 160, which is there. Open, create a new one. And now we just press read. That's going to read my chip. There we go. And now I'll show you. So this, just for you to know guys, this is a, a donor ECU, so I'm not worried about what I'm going to show in there. Even the pin, this is the, the, um, this is the donor ECU, so I'm not going to reuse this ECU. And even if I need to reuse this ECU, I would have to change the pin code on it anyway. So this pin code is completely, uh, even the VIN number, this is from a broken car, it's just a replacement part. But when you look at my data, so the chip starts empty, then line starts to have some data, uh, line 1, this line here, 1B0, and then when you bring it down, you can see in there straight away my VIN number. Let me put a little bit closer, so my VIN number in there, W0, L0, then etc, etc, that's my VIN number, okay, then some more data here. I believe this is the ECU, what is the case? It must be something to do with the ECU numbers perhaps. Yeah, there it is, it's this number here, AK3. So if you see in there, T-R-E-V, look in there, R-E-V, right there, R-E-V, uh, 7F01 AK3. That's, that's the number in there. Then there is some other numbers around here that I don't think they are uh, important. Uh, the rest of the stuff is just uh, uh, numbers, whatever. But my pin number, guys, let me show you where the pin number is. When you start to come down, then you have this empty area here as well. And my pin number is right there. Four seven one eight. Okay, so that's my pin number from this module, and uh, I'm going to use this pin number to reset an engine ECU. Uh, but it will be a video for that. Uh, but yeah, th this video is purely to show you how you retrieve the pin code from a, a airbag module. In this case, 13256904 with uh, the EPROM 95160 from ST. And uh, using Xprog in this case, obviously the reading, uh, any, any software, uh, any other programmer will read exactly the same data. And that's going to be the position where your uh, pin code is going to be. 
and I think that's it for this video guys really five minutes uh, really quick uh, I just thought to share this on a side on a separate video just in case um, someone is looking just purely for this uh, because obviously this is part what I've done now is part of a completely different job which as I said will be a video for it if you haven't seen it already um, and uh, that's it really guys so with no further ado Hope you enjoyed the video, hope there's some information here you find it useful. If you have any questions, any comments, please put them below. And like always, thanks for watching.